five years ago, actually. Here, five, lots changed since. Well, not that much has changed, but I, I'm still not married, still no kids. I am a, I did become an uncle for the fifth time. But don't applaud that. Who cares about being an uncle? Uncles don't do anything. If you've been to the bookstore, there's a whole section on parenting. There's no uncle books. Nobody ever wrote, like, what to expect when your sister's expecting. In a lot of magazines about parenting, there's no Uncle Weekly magazine. What would an article be in that magazine? Is your nephew out of control with drugs and alcohol? Well, since it's not your problem, here's some weekend getaway ideas. <laughs> Can't believe five years since I've been here before, 30 years since I graduated high school, I was just at my reunion. You know, Facebook has ruined the high school reunion as we know it. You used to go to a high school reunion. It was fascinating because you hadn't seen people in years. It was fun to see what happened to everyone. I went to mine. I see everybody on Facebook. I could have stayed home. <laughs> I'm going up to people like, oh my God, you haven't changed a bit since that new profile pic you posted last night. <laughs> Come on. That, that's funny. I think dating is a lot easier. Now, we got text messaging now. When I first started trying to date, you had to call a girl up and have what's known as a conversation. Calling girls up, I, I'd be shaking like a leaf. I'm like, hey, deb, so, uh, b d maybe we can have coffee or something. But texting is easy. I'm like a different person. I'm like, yo, baby girl, what you doing with your fine self? <laughs> Why don't you shake that booty on over here? Then she gets to my apartment. I'm like, girl, you looking fine tonight. She's like, I'm standing right here. Why are you still texting me? <laughs> that happened to No! What? Oh, oh. Keep going, Do I keep, keep going. Go? No, it happened to me recently. Simon, I got a joke for you. You should have waited. You, you jumped the gun on this one because you're going to love this next bit. You're going to love By it. accident, I texted my cousin Sheila, come over, I'm horny. Right. But I, as soon as I realized what I did, I apologized. I said, oh my God, cousin Sheila, I'm so sorry. That, uh, that was actually meant for somebody else. So uh, sorry you came all the way over here. <laughs>